so, so, so. With the cancellation of Scalebound, the S my one only had Halo Wars 2, Crackdown 3, and State of Decay 2. Really? Oh yeah, Seas of Three, uh, Seas of Seas of Thebes. Really now, that's it. That all you guys have. You see, that's the thing here. You know, Scalebound like one of them games that um I actually would consider buying an Xbox for. I mean, my stuff they have an Xbox when we played Guild War together. And I'm like, that was like another game ball we played and beat Guild War for. So. They're like one of them, one of them only other reasons to get an Xbox One, but scale bow going out, really. <sighs> well, you know, as a Sony fan or whatever, a person that on a PlayStation, it's just the greatest thing about on a PlayStation. There's like over fifteen exclusives coming this year, and more coming in two thousand eighteen. I mean, PlayStation Experience alone, like literally. Uh, now so many damn games, you just can't help but to sit there like, damn, we get a lot of games, right? Xbox, there is no big exclusive besides Halo War that they get in. They they literally cannot compete when it comes to actual games. And then the mess up thing is, I'm not even fanboying right now. This is just true facts here. And the mess up thing is that Microsoft actually declared this year the year of the Xbox Scorpio when it's come out like the last two damn months like of this damn year you can't be it can't be your year if you come out the last two months and here's the thing here you can have all the horsepower in the world but the lack of the shit that actually matter which is games there's no way they can win that is all I gotta say you could I mean literally if you look at that that's nothing but Sony stuff right there and the thing is, I play so many different genres. It, it, you know, Sony appeals to me due to the fact that one, they got they got a whole lot of JRPGs. Two, they got a lot of action adventure games. They got a game for everybody, basically, with Sony. And you know, most Xbox fans, they play shit like Call of Duty or Titanfall, shit that you could find on PlayStation Four as well. You know, mostly like you don't hear like some people like brag about uh, like Gears of War or Halo or something like that. They talk about COD or some other shit. Some shit that you could get on PS4. And like I said, most Xbox gamers you don't play a vast variety of different games. So they don't understand why us PS4 gamers like PS4. Like, man, you, you're just playing Tales of Hysteria or Tales of Berseria. What the fuck? Dude, you need to be playing Halo. I'm like, man, leave me the fuck alone, dog. You actually care about Dragon? Well, Scalebound, a actual dragon game? Come on now, man. What is you, eight? Dog, come on, man. We got to play Call of Duty. I don't know. That shit's just crazy, man. But anyway, it's a sad day for those who actually were considering getting an Xbox One for this game. I'm one of them, but uh, I guess I will play my stepdad's Xbox One. And don't buy my own. Whenever they bring a game out that I actually want to play. Hopefully this game gonna be PS4. That'd be epic. But anyway, tell you guys thank. Make, make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. I'm sleepy as fuck, but now I gotta head to work. Have a good one. Peace out.